Hi everyone, here's a new progress video on a feature we've been working on for quite some time. As previously demonstrated, we are simulating the hydraulics down to every control actuator having their own real-time control loop to match the fly-by-wire demand. Control surfaces are impacted by the wind and airflow around the plane, which will cause aerodynamic hinge moments that the actuators have to fight in order for the control surface to stay at the commanded position. Previously, this was only cosmetic having no impact on the flight model. As development continues, enjoy this first demo of our hydraulic control system affecting the plane controllability. Let's try something risky. Let's shut down the blue and green hydraulic systems. And let's silence that barking dog. As you can see, we are now losing more spoilers and eventually all ailerons. Right, so here I'm applying full roll inputs, and the plane becomes really slow to respond in the roll. And the elevator asymmetry is also causing some roll effect that the roll spoilers try to mitigate. You might find that the aileron position is strange. Well, that is because lower pressure over the wing is sucking them up, and their position will be affected by airspeed and angle of attack. Okay, enough with the risky maneuvers, and let's turn the hydraulics back on. With only two spoiler panels missing, roll is almost nominal. Eventually, with all the hydraulics on, we finally have our A320 back in business. Hope you enjoyed that little test flight, and see you soon with a big surprise with some flight computers.